To begin, you must have the following. Switch keys dumped from your Switch, Switch game files, and Switch firmware. I cannot share where you can get those files online, but I'm sure you can find them. I would also like to say prior to starting that I will make an emulator tutorial if you would like that. If so, please let me know down in the comments, but for this video, it will only contain information on the early access version of Yuzu. Once you've obtained those files, then we can start. To begin, you first must head to the desktop mode. Once there, you can open up your preferred web browser and go to the link in the description. This will direct you to a GitHub link that contains the free early access version of Yuzu. Once downloaded, you can close out of your web browser and head to the file browser. Navigate to your downloads folder and move the newly downloaded Yuzu Early Access to some place memorable. Then right click onto the Yuzu Early Access file and go to permissions and check if the option called is executable is checked. Now that you've launched into the Yuzu Early Access version completely for free, now we can head to File, Open Yuzu Folder, then navigate to your keys already downloaded and drop the prod keys and title keys into there. Then go back into the NAND folder, system, contents, registered, and drop your firmware keys into there. Now I'm going to show you how to add your Switch games and how to update them. Click on add new game directory from the Yuzu home screen and select the folder that contains the base Switch game file. To update the newly added game, just head over to the file, install file to NAND, and select the game update file. This will automatically install the update file. And that's it. Now you will get better performance running Yuzu on your Steam Deck. This is because now we're using the early access version of Yuzu, which was completely free. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed.